Hey guys, Aura134 here, and I've got a deck profile for you guys. This weekend at Locals, I was originally going to be running Dragunities, but I found out that I'm probably going to be going to a regional in Edison shortly. Hopefully it doesn't go bad. So I decided to test the deck that I'm going to be running there, which is a uh, Mermail Atlantean. I, this is, I, I wanted to run this build instead of uh, Macro Rabbit, just because... It's going to be next format, and I feel that Mermails are going to still be really good and one of the top decks until uh, Lord of the Tachyon Galaxy. Then I'm going to be playing both Evil Rabbit and Prophecy mostly. But anyways, uh, here's the deck. I built this based off of uh, the build that Billy Brake ran because I really did like his build, and I would just try to get rid of Undyne's... Un <coughs> Excuse me, Undines, but I wasn't, I didn't have a lot of time to test it, so I based off of his bow, then changed some things to make it fit my playstyle better. Uh, first thing, two Megalo. I don't have three Megalo. I don't know if I'd be running three Megalo if I had it. Probably would, but I don't have three and I'm not spending the money on it. Uh, three Abyss Toys. This has a lot of consistency to the deck, and you can pretty much grab whatever you need. Uh, one Abyss lead, you never summon him off his own effects, although I did, uh, when I was in top four, I had to summon Abyss lead by his own effect because that was my only play. It's pretty terrible. Luckily, I won that game and got to the finals. Uh, three Lindy, because Lindy's amazing. Three Abyss Pike. Great card to thin the deck. And then I was teching one Mermail Abyss Turge. And I loved it. Um, when you play Abyss Turge, you discard the water, and you get a level 3 or lower water monster from your graveyard back to your hand. So you're essentially summoning it, pitching a card, proccing an Atlantean effect, and playing it for free. And you can get back another Atlantean, you can get back Diva. You can do some really stupid plays where you'll be able to they'll ditch uh Gunda, grab uh, Pike from the graveyard and grab another Atlantean piece, kill another thing, and then overlay. I really like the Turge. I think it's worth running one of. Two Mermail Abyss Gunda because special summons are amazing. And a searchable ammo piece is pretty great. Next, uh, three Atlantean Dragoons because it facilitates the deck. Three Atlantean Marksmen just because it, it it's such a good card. It pairs well, great with Diva, to help make plays even be uh, bigger. Hits face downs. Level three. It's a great card. Two Atlantean Heavy Infantry. I think it's a really important card to have to be able to destroy the face up cards. Plus, it can help you make some pretty big Diva plays. And speaking of Diva, the last three monsters are three Deep Sea Divas. Magic card lineup. You got Reborn, Darkhole. And Heavy Storm. Got Pot of Avarice. And then all that's left is Trip MST. My trap lineup is also pretty simple. Just got a uh, Double Compulse, Triple Abyss Sphere, and then Double Abyss Squall. This card was great. I won so many games with Abyss Squall, it isn't even funny. Just being able to bring everything back, this card, these are like instant, uh, this is an instant Xyz monster, and whatever Lindy summons. It's great. Um, so that's the deck, it ends up as 40 cards. Onto my extra deck. One Gachi Gachi Gontetsu. One Mermail Abyss Trite. One number 17 Leviathan Dragon. One Abyss Dweller for the Mirror Match. One Bahama Shark. One Big Eye. Two Abyss Gaius. Card's great. One Armory Arm. One Cataster. One Hyper Librarian. One Deloran. Gungnir. Scrap Dragon. And Mistworm. 
And then I only ran a 13 card side deck. I was originally planning on getting overworked um, from my store, but my store didn't have them, and apparently nobody I can seem to contact has this card. I thought I had this card, but I can't find it. So, 13 card side deck. Triple max C. One spell shattering arrow. Two goes end match. One Imperial Iron Wall. Two Shadow Imprisoning Mirror. Two Mind Crush. And two Dust Tornado. Uh, that was the deck. Uh, comment what you guys think below. It's pretty standard for Mermails. And hopefully I got my invite with it. Catch you guys later.